was some lame bullshit. Hold backward and get kicked in the face because the game doesn't want you to fucking block. Excellent. I hate arcade mode. This is they cheat. I swear to God the game cheats in arcade mode. It didn't super turbo. Why not now? Look at this. Oh, finally. Watch how much damage. It's like a Zangief 360 for no reason. Oh, I'm way too far away for that shit, you idiot. Oh, come on, fly! Fuck. Great. Fuck! Oh my god, dude! I didn't do anything one against again. He, he teleports, I block, and he fucking gets an uppercut. Okay. If you say so, cheating ass game. This is the game just assume, you know, like, maybe I was thinking of doing something, but I never released back, but the game says, oh, well, you were gonna do something. Here, punch you in the face. Super Turbo was worse. Super Turbo, the character, like the, a computer would do combos you can't actually do in the game. The combos would do like twice as much damage as they're supposed to. And they had this psychic ability that this game, the, the computer has in this game. That's how bad it was in Super Turbo. Oh my god, he kicked right through it. Wow, perfect dragon punch. Wow, another perfect dragon punch. Look at this shit. Jump. Another perfect dragon punch. right there. Oh my god. That is more bullshit. I did the ultra right in his face and the fucking thing didn't come out. Yeah, shut up. Shut up, sucky character. <laughs> I love during the early stages of a fighting game like this, people are like, oh, well, at Midwest Championships this weekend, Flo got second with Jury. Well, how about Flo's probably the only person who actually played seriously with her, so no one knows how to fight her yet. It's the fucking, like, second weekend the game's out, and people think that, like, she's a great character. You won't know her for, like, six months at least, of people playing her hardcore and trying to win with her. Everyone's going to lose to her at first, just like with Seth. Everyone was losing to Seth at first because no one knew what to do, but now that everyone knows what to do, Seth gets fucked up. Bitch. Oh, he's gonna hit me. Watch. He's gonna hit me because I was pressing a button. Oh, good. Fuck your mother. Fuck your dad. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. It's gonna hit. <laughs> Suck on this bitch. <laughs> I hit it perfectly. The perfect anti-air hit. What an asshole. Well, I got him. Took a while longer because I don't really know what the fuck I'm doing with her, but I got him. On the hardest difficulty. And she says, ah ha 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 ha. That's her win quote. Satisfied? No. Which you had a small dick. I knew all along that you had no intention of following my orders. I was well aware of your impending betrayal. <laughs> You're giving yourself way too much credit. Defeating you was nothing but an added bonus. 
I just wanted to pit you idiots against each other while I took over. Yeah, no one who knows oh, please Taekwondo could ever be the lead, the winner. <laughs> Taekwondo sucks. Squishes Dragon Balls. Aww. Good night, sweet friends. Rest in peace. <laughs> wow. Guess we better find a new hobby. Well, she's right. He was just another fucking body for Bison. And somehow he got AI and went rogue. So she kills him. Wow, that's the end of Super Street Fighter 4. She kills Seth. Big deal. <laughs> so, so far, none of the endings whatsoever have really affected the actual... Street Fighter story at all, and most of them are just rehashes or insignificant bullshit like that. Like, who cares? <laughs> Woohoo!